The Torah teaches us, do not kindle a fire in your homes on the Shabbos day. Rabbi Yeshaya Hurwitz, the great Kabbalist of the 1500s, explains that beyond the basic meaning of, of course, lighting a fire on Shabbos, the Torah is teaching us about another fire, the fire of anger, the fire of strife, the fire of conflict. And there's a special mandate and directive from the Torah that especially on Shabbos, we should see to it that there is peace and serenity between husband and wife and family members. In fact, our rabbis tell us the Shekhinah, the presence of God permeates in the home when there is peace and serenity. It's like, you know, if there's fighting and arguing and lack of understanding, uh, uh, imagine God, so to speak, knocking at the door and hearing all of the arguments, excuse me, I got the wrong house. I, I, I'm not coming in here. Rabbi Moshe Soloveitchik asks the following question. When a husband and wife or family members have strife and disagreement, who is the victor? The one who holds their position or the one who apologizes, the one who looks away, the one who compromises? And he says, surely the victor, the strong one, is the one who compromises, the one who looks away because in that way, we bring the presence of God into our home. Let us have a peaceful and joyous Shabbos.